In a women's catchaway fight at UFC fight night, you got Emily Deco coming in at 12 and 7, taking on Lupi Godinez, who comes in at 9 and 3. Both fighters 5 2. Both 29 years old, right in their prime. Deco's got a two inch reach advantage. They both stand right handed. Now, here's the difference maker Deco, 6.2 significant strikes per minute, Lupi just 3.4. But Lupi lands more than a takedown per round. So again, it comes down to takedown defense. Right now for uh, Dakot, it's 100%. So you think, okay, she's going to stop all the takedowns. But that's only in two UFC fights. She lost to Angela Hill, as she should. Uh, 182 to 71 in significant strikes. She beat Jessica Panay. That's a good win by decision and doubled her up in significant strikes, just about. Now, on the other hand, Lupi Godinez has more fights. She's coming off the win over Cynthia Calvillo by split decision. That's a big one. Lost to Angela Hill, but outstruck her. Common opponent. Beat Ariane Carnalusi and Luma Luke Boomby. So, this one's pretty easy to me. I mean, I'm in favor of Godinez here. I, you know, she might struggle in one of the three rounds at significant strikes, but she'll land takedowns in two out of three rounds, gain the control, and get the victory. And also the common opponent, Angela Hill. Kind of shows you a matchup there. I just like Lupi Godinez to win this fight. I don't often go against a striker, but I just think Lupi Godinez has more experience. She's going to get the takedown. She's going to find a way to win the fight, as she's shown in the past. So she wins, in my opinion, to move to 10-3 and three, women's catchweight at UFC Fight Night.